The 12, I think the 12 is an important watch. It's the perfect size. When I first saw it, I thought I'll have one of those. The 36mm 12 is not a men's watch, not a women's watch, it's a, it's a watch for everyone. For those with smaller physiques like myself, it sits better on the wrist. This is why we decided that the 1236 was the perfect watch for everyone. 36 is the new 40. 36 is the new 40. <laughs> <laughs> When I saw the 12 40mm, I thought it was a really brilliant watch. Loved the design, but it was just a tad too big for me to wear. So when I saw the 1236 come along, I was really excited. People would assume that you take the original 40mm design and you just shrink it down, but then the proportions start feeling a bit strange because something that you can't change is the thickness of the movement. Yeah. So this still has the SW200 in it. Uh, we thought for a smaller size like the 36, we should uh, decrease some of the proportions slightly just to make it feel more, more cohesive at uh, this new size. Traditionally, women's watches are smaller, pink with diamonds, uh, which is a very old fashioned way of looking at it. Because we're, we're coming to a more sort of fluid society, is it, is it that people's perceptions about what they can and they can't do or what they can and they can't wear is broadening? I think that designing a watch for a broader number of people has become easier recently because people are more open to wearing what they like. The 1236mm could be the only watch in your collection. It spans both the dress and dive ranges quite well. The fact that it's an integrated bracelet means that you get more presence even though it's a 36mm. It shows what finishing is capable at a lower price point. I really like them. With a sports watch, you don't need to know the date. It's literally just about knowing the time. Um, and I think I think these are these these are perfect, if I'm honest. For the 36mm, we've got two new colours, one which is a silvery white dial with rose gold indexes, and also a new mint green colour called Frosted Lichen. I think it's important because it continues the expansion of watch brands in general, creating watches that can be worn by anyone. It's not gender specific, it's a conscious decision to make beautifully designed smaller watches. Mm -hmm.